guys so today I'm gonna show a little bit of what we're doing to the chicken coop we actually bought more chickens as you've seen on the last video we're gonna expand um, the space the run space and we're gonna make the chicken coop bigger um, so I'm gonna show you a little bit of that process okay so So this is what we're doing. So what you got going on right here? This is for critters. You, you, you ground the foundation, you get the fence at least 16, 20 inches below the ground. Oh, okay. So when they try to dig underneath. All right, so are you expanding the coop out this way? Yeah. All right, guys, so this is where the coop is gonna be. They're going to be giving it a better foundation. As you can see, they're going a few inches underground. So. So what, you, what has he got you doing? Burying the rocks in the ground, you know. So we kind of seal it off from all the rodents that try to dig and undermine under it. Oh, okay. It's a roadblock for them. So what are the rocks for, babe? For the protection, so if they drill down and... I don't know. I feel like the rock might be able to bite through the fence. <laughs> rocks are deadly. So when they go through the fence, they still have something for them. Mm -hmm. Okay. So are you going to push that one down too? To go all the way down, then all we're going to do is we're going to try to reinforce the region. Oh, okay. Is that brown one okay? It's like laying there, it's real still. Is it sleeping, that brown one? It look real still. Oh no, no, yeah, it's just sunbathing. All right, guys, so that's it for now. I'll be back to show some more progress as things move forward. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna check the progress here. Um, Oh, we made some progress. Wow. All right, we got the... Foundation and the uh, structural components up. All right, we got some cement going. What? 
leveling, checking the levels. If you put the rock in there, it should be fine. Just hold it right there, babe. Come back up a bit with it. Just kind of, you kind of got to put it in here. That's what I'm saying. Go back to you with it. What are you guys trying to do? Square up and level up. All right, just under uh, some rocky night. That's right. Trying Let's to get it started. I'm get some rocky night. I'll come on with it. With the mud, my body. How much was a bag of concrete? Hmm? <laughs> Get ready, Trey. Come here. I'm gonna find a piece of, I'm gonna find a piece more wood and put rain in there. How long it take for concrete to set? Two days. Two days? Yes. What if it rains? Would it mess it up? By the first so day out? Y'all can, y'all can have... Fine. As long as it doesn't rain too hard, by the first day it should be. So basically, if it rain, it'll mess it up. And look, I got concrete on the cord, so you gotta lift this up before it gets stuck in there. I'll do that for you. You need to get some vitamins, Blake. You're always tired. I'm about to go wash out the trail, okay? Alright. I'm at the top. Yeah, that's Let's check the progress on this side. It's the weather has been bad for the last few days. And this was the first warm day without rain. So you're just covering the cement. Our foundation. And the foundation. You know I mean, we just get that foundation down and square it up. Okay. So basically, you know what I mean, when we're ready to go, you know, because it'd be hard to, to dig around the coop. 
mm -hmm. after we, we, you know what I mean, we do everything. So it's easier to just dig out, you know, square it up, dig it out, yeah. and then move on. Are you guys going to go towards the back too and do that side? Do, how are you going to incorporate that into it? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's going to be the hard part. So that's a remodel? Oh, yeah, basically. Uh, so what's the next step after you dig and after you um, shovel everything? Let the concrete dry for the foundation. Oh, okay. Then we come back and start framing it up. Okay. Get the walls in and the, the roof on. How long does it take for the concrete to dry? Well, it's good. We're going to have a warm weekend. It's going to be warm for the next few days, so that's good. The weather is going to work in our favor. Thank God. We need a break. We had a lot of rain. What are you doing, Trisha? Just compressing it. Oh, okay. The dirt. So it's more tighter and more secure. Mm -hmm. When it rains, sometimes like it will help the fence lift up because the rain will like flood, you know, underneath the dirt or whatever. Mm -hmm. I'm not too familiar with it, but you know, <laughs> I'm still learning. Yeah. Because it's kind of the same concept as plumbing. You know? Yeah. 